okay, that before that, I want to say, I better see Simon as a character in Fontaine or something like that. As a player, well, as a playable character, not an NPC, because I don't know why. I can see him as a Fontaine character. Okay, volume two. The rebirth. And yeah, I'm gonna stop on the remake because that really sours my taste on Final Fantasy in general. However, the Immer Nachtreich soon became plagued by a perpetual nightmare. Tasrak, the wicked dragon, infiltrated the subterranean, crossed the bottom of the sea, and eventually came to roam above the capital. We gonna fight a dragon? Uh, a dragon? The only thing I notice is gloomy weather. Could the dragon be some kind of metaphor? If that's so... Her arch nemesis Tasrak, the Wicked Dragon, is made up of everything that opposes her and rejects her fantasies. Knowing their peril, the people prayed to the Soteria. Okay, no, no, no. Fear. You shouldn't see me like this. What was that? Help me! Somebody, please! Voice sounds familiar. Is it that not Robin Ritter fellow again? Twist and merciful. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Huh? What are you guys doing here? should be the ones asking that. What are you doing here? I'm sorry you have to keep seeing me in such a wretched state. I suppose I'm still not good enough to play the role of a qualified Nocturibon Ritter. Play the role? I'm ashamed to admit it, but I'm not a real knight. Rather, I'm a new actor, who recently landed a job to play the role of a knight in a theater troupe. That's not really something to be smug about. Ah, well you see, that's where you're mistaken. Theater is an essential part of Immenacht Reich's culture. A fantastic theatrical performance is the greatest tribute we can pay to Her Highness. Oh, so this is your local culture? Exactly. So, I'm delighted that I got to play the knight. Why does the princess enjoy the theater so much? Her Highness once said, Celebrate me by staging a play in the wilderness. Bow down to me and bring me beautiful dreams in return for everlasting glory within the eternal darkness. I believe it is because Her Highness appreciates true art and can also sense emotions hidden deep within the souls of humankind. The crystallization and sublime expression of emotion is the heart of theater. People who truly understand theater always have a beautiful, sensitive heart filled with a rich array of emotion. Oh, so that's how it is. Thank you for your answer, Sir Knight. Uh, oh, th thank you so much for calling me a knight. <clears throat> so, basking still in this honor, I will be off to my battleground. May we meet again. Hopefully not. Be more careful in the future. Oh, and please remember the password to unlock the gate. Upon my command, spread your wings and take flight. Yeah, I bet we're gonna meet him for the time. Third time. You know the worst thing. Ha. 
Upon my command, spread your wings and take flight. I suppose Bama is one that says this. Ah, the book has appeared. Wait, this mean is over or we just found it now? No, I think we Yeah, we close with this. My most esteemed father and mother, today is celebrated as a festival in the Imanakreish, and I hope you can both spare some time. <sighs> Amy, come on now, darling. You can't be carrying on like that at this age. You're a big girl now. It's time to forget the fairy tales. Uh, but... Oh, and I almost forgot to mention, I've bought you a new set of music course books. Give them a read, won't you? You should dedicate your time to something more meaningful. Oh. Uh, okay, Mom. I, um, uh, I understand. We're back again. I believe we have just witnessed the true nature of the Wicked Dragon. Uh, this is something I am all too familiar with. There are always people who believe that our passions are a waste of time. Yep. Yes, you know, you did yours. And yeah, the Wicked Dragons, the pants. Huh? You're... Ask me for directions, Arnold. Uh, I mean, you're back. Why? Oh, but I came because I bet you'd be looking for the third volume of Hymn of the Holy Land. Well, you bet right on that front. You need not do anything for me, my dear lady. The opportunity to behold your beauty is the finest reward I could ask for. I shall give you the answer you seek. The third volume of Hymn of the Holy Land can be found on the top floor of the royal castle. Is it guarded by anyone? Oh, 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 but of course, sir. What sort of question is that? No nation would treat its most treasured books as if they were just cast out into the wilderness. That means we will still find Nachtraben guard stationed there. It is a citizen's utmost honor to guard the sacred scriptures. But, it matters not. I'm quite sure the fine lady merely seeks to peruse them, and has no malicious intentions. Your face is captivating and full of wisdom, and the company you keep appears to be heroes of some renown. I have the utmost faith that you will be able to comprehend the meaning behind the stories in our sacred scriptures. Her Highness's accomplishments were documented by Oz, the Great Secretaire, and became great treasures of the Immernachreich. I wish Her Highness joy and happiness every time I read those books. Oh, oh, what should I do? Uh, <clears throat> would you care to join me for a cup of coffee, good lady? If coffee is not to your taste, we can have black tea, milk tea, or hot chocolate instead. If you don't want to, that's perfectly okay. I'll keep my distance and be with you in spirit as you enjoy a drink on your own. Your joy is my joy. I can only see the memes with this cabin at Malasim. Stop! <sighs> It's you guys again. What's your problem? We're the princess's personal retainers. Cut the lies. Her Highness doesn't keep company with nobodies like you. Oh, really? Are you prepared to take responsibility for what you just said? I'll say it again. Her Highness doesn't keep company with... Who are these nobodies you speak of? Her Highness and Sir Oz. I must say, guards, it's immensely disrespectful of you to make such remarks to the retainers of the Imanakreish. <sighs> How dare! 
dare you treat one's hand-picked retainers with such disdain? Be gone! But... Don't you but me! Y yes your Highness. Fischl! Eyes! You're back in the crew! Hm. You may consider that the case for the time being. What Main Fräulein means is that it took us a long time to reach this place. She couldn't bear to leave you all here, even though she did not wish to confront this mirage. Didn't want to confront it, huh? <sighs> Sounds like Mona was right. It felt like we were peeking into your diary. Nonsense. Despite the existing threats, the unrivaled glory of the Imanachreich would not exist in this world if I, the Princessin, were the sort of person who could be easily swayed. What Main Fräulein means to say is that there are other troubles in this area. Troubles? Have you run into anything dangerous? Um, this matter can be revisited later. For now, let us proceed with more important work. Let's get this show on the road. The book's right in front of us. Let's not just stand here. Majestic, but fragile. Vast, yet vulnerable. This domain both amazes and sickens me. She means that she has never seen such an extravagant mirage before, and even she is enthralled by it. here, but some parts seem to be missing. Fischl, is this yours? Um, allow me a moment to reminisce. Main Fräulein, you may recall that this is the toy castle you accidentally destroyed in a moment of deep distress. Oz, don't say it out loud! I suddenly recollect that two pieces are currently missing from my royal domain. So we have to find two missing pieces. Smoke amid a downpour of the dragon's blood. She said, May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees. Such wise and compassionate words could only come from your own writing, Main Fräulein. Huh. Yet this kingdom appears to be anything but what I've described. The shadows lurking behind the scenes are disconcerting. Princess Fischl again continued her song, and the interwoven chords of her sacred words became the Immernachtreich's hymn. worshipped her, she replied, Celebrate me by staging a play in the wilderness. Bow down to me, 
and bring me beautiful dreams in return for everlasting glory within the eternal darkness. She picked up mere stones to carve out mountains and oceans before bestowing upon her people castles and towns. My magnificent kingdom is a small and forbidden paradise. That sounds like a happy ending to Paimon. the guess. say that, I can assure you that this will definitely be the last time. Fella, if you want to survive and thrive, you should be more careful next time. A successful journey requires perseverance, courage, as well as a keen sense of danger. You have the first two, but in the future, please strive to be more vigilant. I shall remember your words for the rest of my life. But it is time to say our final goodbye. You may not have noticed, but the weather has improved, and the sea has become pleasant and calm. We have awaited this day for a long time. You may be amazed that someone as reckless as me could become an actor, but please believe me when I say it's not by chance. Every Noct Raven is looking for a way to contribute to the world. We just want to find our place, our destiny. We were born to seek the roles that fate has assigned us to play. You may not be aware that Hymn of the Holy Land is also a book of prophecies. Prophecy? But Paimon thought it was a sacred scripture. Yes, it is. Hundreds of years ago, the Imanacht Reich was engulfed by a menacing shadow. But our ruler stood by and did nothing, as if she had lost interest in ruling the kingdom. Soon after, Oz, the great secretaire, appeared among us. He brought us the sacred scriptures, and a most encouraging prophecy. That prophecy is just as it's described in the book, and predicts a blessed future for the Imanacht Reich. As a result, we became convinced that the gloomy skies would eventually clear, and we have been eagerly awaiting for that blessed day. The Soteria, the Princess and Verurteilung, she will eventually remember the paradise of the Imanacht Reich. And on that day, we will devote to her the plays that were promised in the prophecy. That is why I have stepped forward to take on the role of a warrior. I do whatever it takes to prove my devotion to her. <clears throat> Your Highness! Oh, right! Yeah, she was lurking in 
the back when we rescued you for some reason. My citizen, thy will is strong enough to sunder the wicked dragon's wings. I shall now receive thy blessing. It is my utmost honor. Thou hast done well. Tis almost most evident that thou dost possess the virtues of a knight. Go, take thy position, and wait for the performance to begin. We commend your unfaltering loyalty to Her Highness. Her Highness will now lead her retainers into battle against the shadow that plagues the Imanakreish. Thank you, Your Highness. And thank you, everyone. In that case, I will take my leave. Oh, by the way, please keep in mind that the password for the gate ahead is... Zian, mein Sommernachtgarten. Paimon's confused. What were you guys role-playing just now? <sighs> is there not a single one of my lords and ladies who understood my precepts? Fools. What Main Fräulein means to say is that you are all rather stupid. Take chance to no one. To translate that. I suppose this is the important business Her Highness warned us about earlier. Let's get this over with. Huh? Wait, what is it? What's happening? Zian, mein Silvernacht Garden. There's the book! Let's go and close it! Let's hope we won't get transported to another strange place this time.